But check this out. If you upload an image to Google Vayer 3, which features some instructions of the first frame of how you want the video to come out, Vayer 3 is able to read those instructions and actually perform them in the final output. It's really cool because you can just grab any image as your first frame, go to a site like Canva, for example, here, and just start drawing some boxes around of different aspects of the video that you want to make sure have an action to it. So in this case, I want the astronaut to stand up. I want the fire to diminish in strength. And I also want some sort of dark silhouette thing to appear. When you go over to Google Vero 3 or go to Google Flow, just say you wanted to execute the instructions in the video. And as you can see here, everything happens just as I instructed it. And it's a really cool way to prompt Vero 3.